Hey everyone, this is Neyadi. I hope you all are doing really good. Guys, I'm making this video specifically for the newbies, those who want to take the first step with the back end zone. So in this video, I'll be guiding you how you can download and install. Just go to the Google and type backenzo.com, right? This we uh, website will come in front of you. Do you see this button here? Download Backenzo. Just double click on it. Meanwhile, it is being downloaded. I'll take you to the minimum system requirement. I'll let you know about the minimum system requirement for the Backenzo. A speed of the backtest will be dependent on your PC configuration. WinRAR is must for the backend, so you are requested to download and install the latest WinRAR. I'll also post the link of the latest WinRAR over the description box. So you can download from there. Operating system, Windows 11, 10, 8.1, 8, 7 service pack 1, 10 server, Windows Server 2012 R2, Windows Server 2012, Windows Server 2016, Windows Server 2019 or later processor 1 GHz. i3 or i5 or equivalent recommended. On faster processor, better backtest speed can be observed. About the RAM, 2 GB RAM, 4 GB is recommended for the backend zone. Hard disk, 10 GB free space is required in the system drive, normally in the C drive. Normally, it, uh, between 3 to 5 GB will be used. For the better performance, use NVMe or SSD hard disk. Browser, Chrome, Firefox, Microsoft Edge or Safari, anyone will do. .NET version, .NET uh, 4.6 is required. And if you have desktop, it will always process faster in comparison of a laptop. Okay. Now, as you can see that my setup file is already being downloaded before I proceed ahead with the installation process. I want you to know that Backinso being a professional backtesting platform comes as a paid version. Since the start, no free trials are available. However, you can start exploring with the lowest plan of 501 rupees. Okay. So Backinso comes with two versions. One is basic and other is premium. Okay. So the basic plan comes with the 501 rupees. These are the features that are included in the basic plan that you can perform unlimited backtest and back simulation. With the granular data, you can perform deep backtest analysis on the granular data for more accurate results. You can even perform backtest on uh, the basis of the Greek possible. Backtest on the current week, current month, next week, next month, next to next week, next to next month is possible with the backend. And with this, you can even backtest calendar and double diagonal kind of strategies. The report, it comes in the form of HTML. So you can interact with it. Okay. Indexes, we have three types of uh, indexes. One is uh, Nifty, Bank Nifty, and Fin Nifty. So you can even perform back testing on fin nifty and seven stock options okay let us talk about the premium plan now we charge you 2100 rupees for this premium plan at very cutthroat prices so what are the features of this premium let us talk about it all the features of the back basic plan are included in the premium plan 37 extra stock options are available and in the premium uh, you can even uh, see multi-leg charts in the simulation and 50 plus indicators for the visualization in the chart. Positional and BTST backtesting is only possible in the premium backenzo and not in the basic version of the backenzo. Excel imports, strategy tag and user base reports, additional stock options backtesting, so this was about the basic and the premium plan of Packin. So you can grab the opportunity. And now, as you can see, that my setup is already being downloaded. So I'll just uh, click on this setup file by double clicking on it. It will run the Packin. So setup. Okay. Just click on the I agree to the license terms and condition. Click on the install button. Yes. Setup is in progress. Click on the next button. I accept the terms in the license agreement. Next, next, and install. 
click on the finish button and on the successful installation you can see the b icon at your desktop this is back in zoom okay so i'm clicking on the finish installation successfully completed close it okay double click this icon to start back in zoom for the first time from here, you can create your account with the back and so, okay? So the back and so login has come in front of you. From here, you can create your account with the back and so. Just click on the create account and you can uh, provide all the necessary details like your user ID, name, email, mobile number, password, confirm password, city, state and broker. So after filling in all the details like user ID, name, email, mobile, password, city, state, broker, just click on an I agree button. I agree for the license agreement and then just click on the register and you will be given OTP on your verified mobile number. That is this one, right? So just uh, enter the OTP sent over your mobile number. So I've just entered the OTP, which is sent to my mobile number. OTP can be requested for maximum three times in case you don't get the OTP after second attempt, then just try after few hours. So after entering the OTP, just click on the confirm OTP button. User registration is successful. It seems you already availed demo on this computer. So no demo days will be given. You need to renew before using Backenzo. So Backenzo is a paid application, okay? So you can choose your pricing plan as per your choice. So just enter the user ID and the password. And you will be directed to the renewal form page, okay? So herein you can uh, choose your renewable pe period such as 7 day unlimited Pfizer 1 plan, 30 days unlimited 1100 plan, 90 days unlimited 3100 plan, 30 days premium unlimited 2100 plan and 90 days premium unlimited 6000 plan, 180 days premium unlimited 11000 plan. So for this I'm going ahead with 7 days unlimited 501 plan. Just scan the QR code and enter your payment taxation number. After successful payment, please fill in the transaction ID below and submit for the renewal. Please note, if the payment transaction number is very long, then last seven digit could also be fine. Enter the amount paid here and you can also attach the payment screenshot for the quicker processing of your renewal form. Okay. So this is how you can uh, confirm your renewal. I'll just click on the confirm payment. So after clicking on the confirm payment, this pop-up has come up in front of me that is details submitted, your payment details sent for the verification. Renewal would done only for the successful transaction and it will take few minutes to reflect the renewal. And then you're good to go. Thank you.